Hey everyone, so as we know, um, Ninjago Hands of Time is, it's, it's going to be focusing on, it seems, at least so far, it seems to be focusing a lot on the past and it has already had a big flashback um, part in an episode and everything. And we have, we, we, we've kind of known now for a little while um, that Moro is to be seen in the Hands of Time. Um, so again, it's been asked and Moro is going to be seen, but you know, I think it has already been spoken and talked about that we're not going to be seeing Moro in just like an actual appearance in like a normal way. I think it's we're going to actually just see him, but probably not like um, an actual comeback considering he's in the departed realm now. So it's kind of hard to see him. Um, so my thought is that we'll probably see him in some other flashback. Um, considering this season seems to really focus on, the, you know, like what happened to Kai and his parents, I feel like it's going to go and show the past a lot more than other seasons have before. So I feel like we're going to have several more flashbacks here and sh like that shows what happened and the whole story. And I feel like could Morrow have some sort of connection to this whole thing? Now, as you know, um, Maro was training with Sensei Wu and everything, but then he went out and left to prove Wu wrong and everything, you know, find the first Midgetsu Master's tomb. Well, as you also know, I, yeah, it was probably after Moro was gone by this time, the, the, the Serpentine War and stuff, and I, I, right around there, or a little bit after, Moro was already out there now, probably. So, you know, could he have ran ran into anyone that were currently involved in in Hands of Time, like Kainia's parents, or, you know, maybe like Time Twins or something? Could Moro have any involvement within those characters, you know, in the past? You know, maybe not like a big one, or maybe we'll just like, you know, quickly see him as part of a story, you know, like a previous known fact of him. Maybe it'll just be mentioned again in a way, but shown a little bit. You know, who knows? But do you guys think that he could have some sort of interaction or connection to the Hands of Time story? Or do you think he's just going to kind of be there in the past um, flashback while they tell the real new story? Um, that's kind of what I'm saying. So ultimately, guys, what do you guys think? Do you guys think he'll have a connection to Hands of Time? Or do you guys think he'll just kind of be there in the background in a flashback? Mm -hmm.